Among all the fun happening today is a Cleveland tradition. Yeah, we are talking about the first pour of Christmas ale at Great Lakes Brewery. Well, I think we need somebody to ask if they timed it up with the Browns game. So <laughs> Austin Love, he obviously volunteered for this assignment. Austin, I don't know if it's a coincidence that they're tapping Christmas ale while the Browns crowd is going to be there. I'll tell you what, Maureen, I didn't even think about that. This place is going to be a little <laughs> bit more rowdy than it typically is on the first pour. Yeah, we've got the Browns, we've got the first pour. It's a big Thursday here in Cleveland, and it's also a big deal because whenever I bust out the festive jacket, you know something's going down. And to talk a little bit more about that, yeah, we're hanging out in the beautiful brew pub here at Great Lakes. But we have Adam Ritterspot here with Great Lakes. What's going on, buddy? Welcome back. You look great. And, so do you. Uh, I needed you. that this morning, a little <laughs> MO for, for this Thursday morning. And it doesn't seem that we were here too long ago. We were here in July talking about Christmas in July, That's but right. now we're here for the real deal. What can people expect today? Today is the first poor day. It is, of course, a Cleveland tradition, the yeah. unofficial holiday season kickoff. We'll be opening at 11 a.m. with the first pour of Christmas sale at 11.30. So it's not just the first pour, of course, that's what everyone's excited about, but so many other festive things that we can expect here. Tell us a little bit about that. That's right. We're going to have the Cleveland Carolers singing songs from 10.30 to 11.30 to everybody waiting out nice. outside on the line. We'll have brew nuts joining, here. Are you joining in? How's your voice? You don't want my pitch. No, okay. no, no, no. no. Right, good to know. Brew nuts right. will be out uh, here with some great Christmas sale donuts. We'll have Krampus of Cleveland at 5 p.m. and some DJs at 5. It's going nice. to be a great time. And this has been a tradition since 1992 when they first introduced Christmas Ale, correct? I mean, what, what, what is this? How does this, uh, this event evolve? Yeah, so Christmas Ale, this is our 29th year of brewing it. I mean, it started with Dan and Pat Conway delivering bottles to their family and yeah. friends. And then over the years, it just kind of became this thing where it was the first pour. You got to be at the brew pub for the first pour. And uh, it's kind of quite the event now. Such a Cleveland tradition. And real yeah. quick, there's a few COVID things that people need to know as well. Just, get, just a brief run drop. Yeah, so last year we had a smaller event. Reservations were required. Yeah. This year, no reservations, but we are asking for a vaccination card okay. or proof of a negative test within 72 hours. Okay, definitely good key to know about that. And also, uh, you know, I'm a, I'm a good friend. So I, I know that Dave is dying to get his hands on some Christmas ale, um, but I don't think I'm going to give him the Christmas ale quite yet. How about, how about we try the new Tropi Coastal, Dave? It's the IPA. I want you to come down here and get your own Christmas ale, pal. I'm not going to make it that easy on you. So cheers to you, Dave. How's the new Tropi Coastal? He says he loves it. Um, I, I, I'm saving the Christmas sale for myself. This is liquid gold, guys, and it's in um, little high demand right now. So 11 o'clock, you can come down here and get your hands on one, Dave. Go check it out, pal. And I know you're literally saying right now, look what you did, you little jerk. So I, and I'm, I'm owning it this morning. Cheers. I don't even have anything to come back with, I don't think. Except that, is Christmas sale older than you, Austin? That's all I got for you. 29 no, years now? No, it's not. It's, I, Dave, I was going to say 1992 is an incredibly special year because not only is the tradition started of Christmas sale, the great tradition of Austin Love was also born there, too. So cheers to 1992 and cheers to you. No one loves you like you do. All right, Austin, I'll tell you. that <laughs> got to be your own biggest fan. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Thanks for sharing. Um, and I, we're just going to end. Austin, great job. <laughs> got to get out of here.